Hey guys, Caleb's Cards here, coming at you with episode 607 of my TTML day. This might be a double episode day today, so uh, this is recapping uh, Tuesday's TTMs. Um, I didn't get a chance to film because I was seeing my grandparents down south and didn't get back too late. And then I tried to film yesterday and I, I forgot a TTM so I was like, oh I gotta reshoot. And then... Uh, YouTube wasn't really working, so I couldn't upload the video. So I was like, okay, I'll just redo this another day. So here we are. Um, got a lot of nice ones here. Got a spring training success from Royals manager Ned Yost. And uh, the only spring training uh, requests I sent out were to like managers and coaches. I've pretty much given up on players, so I don't ever have good success at all with spring training. So. I may not even try it at all next year. So, but uh, that was cool. Uh, Ned Yost is always a great signer. Got a uh, Paul Smith signed the archives, 1994 Topps archives card. Got a uh, 87 Topps signed by John Stefaro from his home in Maryland. I believe he is a catcher. Got a really nice one. I've seen, you know, lots of people been getting them back. Uh, I previously had purchased one of his autographs and had also been given one before, so I wasn't like in a hurry to send to him. But I figured, you know, I got the money right with me at the moment, so might as well at least say I was able to send to him TTM. And he did sign, sent him with a twenty dollar donation, signed my four by six photo. It's Mr. Brooks Robinson, the human vacuum cleaner. Put his Hall of Fame nineteen eighty three inscription and all century team. And I thought it was cool as well. He also wrote my letter saying that he enjoyed my letter. So um, I don't know if he normally does it or not for everybody else, but I usually don't see that, so that's pretty cool. Just get a little note back from the Hall of Famer. Got a pro golfer, Alexis Thompson. She's a pretty good up and coming golfer. She's a, about a year older than me. And already having a great success, so it's pretty cool. And then she sent uh, her own 5x7 sign, so it's cool. And then got uh, one for the Battle of the Decades contest, but I don't think it'll count because somebody already got them on the exact same photo, but that's okay. It's a teammate anyway, so that doesn't matter. Uh, the 4K that came out great, but the signature just did not come out at all. <laughs> but uh, still, it's John Lithgow from Harry and Henderson's there. He's doing a play, his own play, in New York. And he's been signing his mail like crazy, so that's cool. And finally, the one that I forgot the first time I tried filming. The World War II success from Great Britain. Now, unfortunately... Um, this man has passed away. He passed away last July. I did not realize that. So uh, this was a 4x6 photo of him uh, boarding uh, before D-Day. I believe he... I think he was this guy, but he actually might have been back farther. If I remember, I cannot remember. So obviously, you know, it's not going to be signed. But his daughter wrote me a note saying you know, he would have definitely been happy to have signed. But unfortunately passed away and she said she came across a couple things that I might like and it's absolutely awesome I cannot believe it so she sent first of all a photo a little reunion he's part of the royal um, what's it called he was a royal engineer but I can't remember like a royal paratrooper or something like that I, I can't remember what the exact name is so there he is in the picture. And then she sent a, a letter about just talking about uh, his experience and stuff. And then she found this a membership card from 1972 to 73 signed by him. So that is absolutely amazing that in the end I still was able to get a signature. And I was not expecting that at all. I noticed that a couple of people had come back saying that he passed away. I was like, oh. So this isn't this isn't gonna come back but uh, that's absolutely cool so I'm gonna have to definitely send her a thank you note 
uh, for doing that. So that, that's really cool. So Ivor Anderson. So uh, that's all I got for you for Tuesday. I'll be back later with uh, Thursday's TTMs. I don't know if I had anything Wednesday. But I know uh, there's definitely quite a decent amount for Thursday. So I'll be right back, guys.